Hi guys, welcome to Final Court Bits, I'm Colin. Have you been working on your timeline and there's a certain, you see a certain bit of your clip that you want to cut out, uh, but you're kind of unsure how to do it? In this example, it's like, just say I'm, I'm making this video, which I have done, and, and I just want to use a clip, yep, say this goal here, you see it's a really nice goal, and I may want to use that in an intro, but it, it's kind of messy to drag it around, you kind of mess in your work, and so how can you kind of cut that out without kind of messing, you know, if I just start cutting it out like this, and I'm just destroying my original, my original clip, which I don't want that. So I'll tell you the technique to do it. As always, option kind of drag duplicates a clip. So you just lift it above basically. So then you've got two on top of each other. And then you find the part you want to cut from. You just work like you cut it like you normally do. So you press option left bracket to that's it. And uh, option right bracket. And you see that's just cut that clip and it and it hasn't harmed this bottom one at all. So I know I've got this goal. And if I want to use that in the intro, I can just drag that to the beginning. Just like that. And I might I might like another section that I want to use as well. So then I'll just do the same basically. So just the option left bracket and that's it. It's pretty clean and just drag. Um, and you've got to make sure you're in air mode. Magnetic timeline is turned on because if you start doing this with P mode, position mode, then you're just going to leave blank spaces around and then it won't stick together again. Um, but A just keeps it magnetic, P doesn't. But in, in this case, you want it in A, just drag it to the beginning. So then you've got little little bits of the footage, which you can, you know, it's always a good idea in a video to kind of put some interesting points at the beginning so that people know what they're kind of getting into at the beginning with a video. And then, you know, you're going to repeat it later on. That's if they get that far. So, yeah, I hope that helps you. And uh, if, you, if you find these videos useful, please subscribe. Hit the like button if you fancy. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for listening. Peace.